the guy who left his calling card across the globe suddenly doesn't want the credit? I asked my name to be taken off. You're right, Lois. I've been drawing too much attention myself. I've been doing this all wrong. Clark, I am sorry. I, I should have known the pressure you were under and not made things more difficult for you. And I should be wearing a mask. Unfortunately, I've lived my entire life up until this point without needing one. That's why I've been so reluctant. I mean, this is the face of the man that my parents raised. It's the, the face of the man that you love. I don't want to deny who I am when I'm out there doing what I was born to do. Then why bother with the jacket, Clark? The symbols. When I'm out there in the red and blue and I'm saving people, that's who I really am. And I know this is going to sound weird, but it's not what I'm called that should define who I am. It's who I am that should define what I'm called. Clark Kent, it's, it's just a name. It's just a word. I am the blur, and I always have been. That is a pretty amazing breakthrough. And I'm really happy to hear it. But if you want to keep doing things like, I don't know, working here and marrying moi, I, I don't see how we're going to make this work. By doing exactly what we talked about. And the answer has literally been staring me right in the face. Clark, the Blur can't just whip out a new costume at work. The Blur is not the disguise loss. Clark Kent will be the mask. Okay. Okay, but the only way that the glasses are ever going to work... If I adjust my behavior when I use them, I know. The world needs to believe that Clark Kent is way too normal to ever be. Super. And even though we've silenced Godfrey, we've shut down Granny's orphanage and buried Desaad underneath Belle Reeve, it's not the last time that we've seen Dark Side. But I'll be ready. Hiding in plain sight. So you're willing to dial back the hometown hero and crank up the average Joe? If that's what it takes to be the hero that people need? Yes, Miss Lane, I am. Did you know that average fiancés let their ladies take them to cake tastings? You just have to act like you're miserable, though. That shouldn't be a problem. You really need to watch where you're going, buddy. Jeff. I am so sorry, Mr. Kent. You know, Jeff, um, it's my fault. I'll try to be more careful next time. You, uh... <clears throat> you probably should. Good job, Mr. Kent.